Hey guys, welcome back to Allstack. Well, uh, today's video is about how to create Windows installation desk without using any third party tool. Recently, I have received multiple comments on my no boot videos where you know uh, the users they were not having a bootable media or they had no idea how to create one. And that's the reason I am going to create this video for you. So the steps are simple. All you need is a USB flash drive or a DVD drive that has at least 8 gigs of free space. It is recommended to have a blank USB or DVD because any content within the uh, USB or DVD will be overwritten by the Windows installation. Okay. Let me quickly show you to you. I have this USB drive attached to my computer as a F drive and if you see it's completely blank. So I will be using this USB drive to create Windows installation media. Back on the page, we are going to create a Windows installation media for Windows 10. So you got to click on the Windows 10. It will take you to the downloads page where we are about to download Windows media creation tool. On the page, click on download tool now to start downloading media creation tool. It's hardly few megs, so it should not take long. Let's open the downloads folder and right click to install the tool using an administrator account. Hit yes for the USC prompt. The tool has started. It says getting few things ready. I will fast forward the videos as it takes a while to do the processing in the background. Okay, accept the terms and condition. Let it take its own sweet time. On this page, select create installation media USB flash drive or DVD because we do not want to upgrade the existing PC. So select the second option and hit next. Here you can leave the settings to default. This is the recommended option for this PC. So we'll not make any changes. Next, which media to use? Uh, we will use USB flash drive, not planning to use the DVD because if you see on my computer, I have USB. The CD DVD is a virtual uh, device. It's a virtual machine. So we will be creating a bootable USB flash drive. I select bootable and hit next. The tool automatically identifies the flash drive later. So in my case, the F drive is where the USB is mounted. So I just hit next because it has identified the correct letter. After this, it will start downloading your Windows 10 installation uh, files on your USB. Uh, trust me guys, so this takes a while depending upon uh, how fast your internet speed is. What I will do is fast forward the video and continue once the download completes. Anyway, please hit like and subscribe. Okay, the download has completed. At present, it is verifying your downloaded files. After that, it will start creating Windows 10 installation media. I'll again fast forward the video and resume once this completes. Finally, your USB flash drive is ready to use. Let me click finish and let's, try, let's navigate into the USB to see what files it has downloaded. It is just trying to clean up the uh, files before we close this window. Okay, so that's my EST USB uh, F drive. Let's try to get into the F drive and I'll show you the Windows files. That is setup.exe which will start the Windows installation. Okay, just to verify that's the USB. I have files written into that USB. So let me try to click on setup.exe. It will it will load that Windows installation. Um, it will start the installation process. Okay. So this is just to verify that we have successfully created a Windows 10 installation uh, USB flash drive, which you can use to fix any no boot issues that you are working on. Okay. So guys, I hope you find this video helpful. If yes, please do support the channel. Please do subscribe and hit a like and leave a comment if this doesn't work. We'll work together to fix any issues that you may get. So thank you for watching the video. Have a great time ahead. Cheers.